Bloody hell, mate. We'll just take my undies off for a second here. And look at the trash inside here. Guys, we are back for another blocked drain. And I mean, what on earth did you think we were here for? It's not a cooking channel, although I'm telling you right now, that looks like something I cooked up for dinner last night. I'm not much of a cook, but I tell you what, I'm one absolutely bloody champion plumber. Anyway, enough of me blowing my own trumpet. And look at the disgrace right here. I mean, it smells like money, guys. It's an overflowing grease trap. And look at it. This grease trap looks like it had way too much for dinner last night. And it is absolutely spewing its guts out, mate. All right, guys. I've got the headset in now so you can hear me loud and bloody clearly. Oh, well, I, I guess there's a few of you that's probably uh, got me on mute anyway. I read the comments and yes, 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 I see them. You know, oh, shut up, Bruce. You know, you're like a bloody broken record, mate. And I understand that, you know. The mute button is there for a purpose. But anyway, for those left listening, I hope you can hear me loud and clearly. So... Grab the camera, we'll bring her over here, and guys, I mean, look at that. Look at it, it's glorious. Let's lift these lids, guys. I can't wait. I mean, this is what I live and breathe. I live for this stuff. Bloody. Bloody hell, mate. All right, we'll try and fit these Gaddock lifters to this lid and see if we have any more luck. Maybe this one needs to come up first. But guys, I mean, now, the gentleman at this Chinese restaurant didn't realise how badly the drains are blocked. And I mean, I love my Chinese food. And this oil that's coming out of the grease trap is certainly not going to put me off it. You know, I'll probably go in and have a nice bowl of Chinese after this. But anyway, let's get these lids off. I reckon there's a business opportunity just staring me down the bloody barrel right there. I mean, what? Drain Cleaning Australia Moisturiser. I'll show you how this grease trap runs anyway, guys. So it comes from the Chinese restaurant into the inlet of the grease trap there. It flows through to the outlet, through the gully, and then it will go downstream to the, you know, to the council sewer, mate. But uh, it looks like there's an issue with the gully. All right, guys, I'm going to start with Mr. Gun, and we're going to try and just blast the bottom of this gully and just see if it's just a build-up of food scraps. We might get this sorted pretty quickly. Let's have a go at it. And so remember, once we have this clear, the levels should drop, the tank should drop 50% from where it is now. What the heck is that? Wow. I mean... I hope the camera bloody caught that. What were you doing that? That's... I've seen it all, guys. I've seen it all. But anyway, let's continue on. Have we got this sorted already? No way. The level's dropping inside the tank. Could we be that lucky? I mean, it's one of those videos. It could be over before it started. No. I don't know. Now let's continue on guys, it's uh, I think we're going to have to bloody just continue on, that's what we'll do. Yeah there's probably going to be all sorts of rubbish down here, I mean I don't know, oh the great is, it's, the great's gone bloody walkabouts hasn't it, but look at that, I'm trying to get you guys close to the action here, you know. You can almost feel it, you can almost smell it, and what on earth is coming out of this drain? More rubbish. More rubbish. Wow, look at that. And I mean, there's method to the madness, you know. I'm trying to 
blast this in a way where we're just trying to kick up a bit of rubbish and look at that you know we've got a, we've got a bit of a collection going on now and i might have to ebay this off but anyway we'll persist we'll continue on i'm here for the long haul guys you know you know me i don't leave until the job is complete until we're a hundred and 25 percent you know 100 percent is not good enough you've got to put in the extra the little extra and people look at you funny every time you say 110 125 percent and they think you're bloody mad but anyway guys the levels are not dropping here no they're not what i mean if they were the gully would be running clear that's what we want to see we want to see the gully running clear let's continue on and let's absolutely annihilate this one guys Hey, 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 there we go. And I mean, where would you rather be? Tell me. In the comments, tell me, where would you rather be? No one has ever commented and convinced me that there's a better place to be than right here with me unblocking a drain. And guys, you know, I am living the drain. Living the drain? I'm living the bloody dream. And see, I've got drains on the mind. But once again, look, I don't think we've sorted this. Well, we haven't sorted it. The levels, have they slightly dropped? I think they may have slightly dropped. Are they dropping? They are dropping. Look at that, guys. Let's have a look at the gully here. No real movement, but... We'll continue blasting, guys. I'm just bloody... You know, I'm just enjoying this. I don't know about you guys, but I'm bloody enjoying this. And people say to me week in, week out in the comments, oh, you can't enjoy it. You just say it for the attention. And mate, no, I don't, you know. I actually enjoy my job. And I don't know what more I can do is to just continue unblocking drains and bloody, you know, having a laugh with you guys. So anyway, I'm going off topic once again. Are we unblocking this grease trap? Let's have another look. The levels... The levels are slow. I, I think we've got a partial unblockage. Is that a word? A partial unblockage? We've partially unblocked it. I think that's what I was reaching for. But let's continue on. And yes, I mean, I know what a few of you are thinking right now. Bruce, pull out Mr. Bloody German. What on earth are you doing? Pull out Mr. German Jet. He will come and save the day. And yeah, I'm going to, but I'm just being a little bit bloody stubborn now, you know. I've started with Mr. Gun. I wanted to prove a bloody point, and so far it's not really working. But I'm going to continue because I'm a stubborn prick. Oh, come on, mate. Let's have another look. Are the levels dropping? The levels are dropping. You know, Mr. German is just kicking back in the toolbox right now going, do you know what? I'm having the day off. While Mr. Gunn is just getting things sorted. But are the levels dropping? Yeah, they're dropping. Well, I mean, any of you sitting on your spinny chair in the office right now, in front of your computer, I mean, wouldn't this just be one of those great desktop screen-saving backgrounds, you know? A grease trap like this, just slowly draining away. I mean, you'd have everyone in the office spinning their chairs right over to you and going, oh, where did you get your bloody screensaver? You know, can I have it? Can I have a link? Because I want one too. And then you just send them to Drain Cleaning Australia where they get to bloody see, I don't know, over a hundred videos like this, mate. But anyway, I'm talking absolute crap once again and look you can see the baffle now that baffle right there is, is supposed to separate the oils and the food scraps and all the rubbish from the last part of this tank just here stops it from going out to the main sewer and what we're going to do is we're going to unblock this and then we're going to call out a pump truck well it's not my responsibility to do because that's the owner's responsibility so let me rephrase i'm going to highly suggest to the owner he needs to get the pump truck in asap like today now yesterday in fact because we're going to clear this and the state the grease traps in currently it's going to re-block again mate so he's going to need to get a pump truck truck out today you know kitchens commercial kitchens you know, restaurants they need grease traps pumped out every four weeks or so for them to you know 
continue working the way they should. I mean, look at the trash inside here. Anyway, guys, it's running, but I just don't feel like this grease trap is running as quickly as it could be. But I mean, look at that, you know? And look, you know, I may be losing a few viewers right now because I am talking garbage. We're literally looking at garbage. You know, it's a slow process, but for you still here, it's a slow burn this video. You know, I feel like we've got a bit more to go. So, Mr. Gun, oh, look at that. So we'll give her another blast. And yes, I'm still being stubborn. You know, this is about the time where I really should be getting the German jet out, but I reckon we're close. Let's have another look in here. Look, it's speeding up again. I mean, it's a, you know, I've said it before, guys, and I'm going to thrash the line out because I, I think it's funny. But it's a Picasso, you know? An absolute Picasso. A work of bloody art, mate. You know, you could frame that. And no disrespect to the artists out there that I've seen some artwork around the world, mate. And, you know, personally, I reckon this is a little bit better than what I've seen out there, you know? Oh, maybe I just don't have an eye for art, but I've got an eye for grease traps, and this is just marvellous, mate. Anyway, we're going to keep on blasting because we need to see the outlet pipe in that grease trap to know when we're at the right level. So we'll keep going, guys, and hopefully whatever's stuck down the bottom of that gully, we can just smash right through it, and we will be on the way to the next job you know, quicker than you can say. Bob is your mother's bloody brother, but have another sticky beak. Look at that. There we go, there's the outlet pipe. We are getting closer. We are getting much closer. Yes, yes, yes. You know what time it is, guys. I have heard you screaming through the screens. We got Mr. German Jet out and look at that son of a gun. I mean, he just looks the part. He looks ready and raring to go. And I feel like this drain is, you know, 90%, 95% clear. But if it's only 95% clear, it's a hundred percent bloody blocked. Let's fire the jet up. <laughs> All right, guys, the moment we've been waiting for, Mr. German is gonna show us what he's all about. Don't want a copper mouth, we'll put that over there. But sometimes you've got to push your booty into it, guys, because I've had too many block drains in my mouth. And look at that down there, bringing you guys right into the action. It looks like a washing machine down there. And Mr. German Turbo Nozzle is just making sure that she, whoa! <laughs> oh, guys, I mean, I had a little bit in my mouth, but it's all good. Let's continue. Let's stop worrying about a little bit of this in my mouth. And there's a glove. There's a nut. Look at that. You know, we were there fiddling. Oh, we were there fiddling around with the gun for a while. And German's been in there for a minute and he's already pulled a bloody glove out. I've said it before, guys, and you find a job you love. You'll never work a day in your life. And so far, over the past 15 years, I haven't been to work, guys. I've just been living the bloody dream. All right, so let's have another look inside the grease trap, and that is looking a lot more respectable. Still needs a good pump out. Have a look in here. All right, wait, look, you're ready for your caramel sauce bath now. How much? Would 50 bucks do it? 100 bucks? Let me know. All right, here's Mr. Big UK. Mr. Big UK, he's obviously from the UK, this plunger. He's an absolute ripper, you know, just like the people from the UK. Just ripper people, absolute ripper people. But let's plunge. Let's just see if we can get anything that could be lurking down the bottom of the gully. I think we're done, but just, you know, better safe than sorry. And for you older subscribers to the channel, you'll remember this guy. He's the guy that saved the day many times. The plunger. I will never retire because he still comes in handy. The number of times he saved the day for me, he's, uh, you know, most people would have chucked him out. But not me. 
Look at that! As I say, he's got a job for bloody everything, mate. You retire this guy, you may as well shut your business down. He's just, he's, I think I should bloody patent this. Look at that, is that, you know, we've had the gun, we've had the German down there, we've had Mr. Big UK, and now, Mr. Retired Plunger has bloody pulled a cloth out. I mean, he's making everyone look like a fool. And I reckon that's all she wrote, mate. I seriously think we've just done an absolutely magnificent job. I mean, look at it, guys. Yeah, really, how much to jump in? Oh, do you know, I reckon it'd probably take me 500 bucks to bloody jump in and you know, get down in my undies and just have a nice scrub-a-dub. Now, I'll just show you what a pristinely running grease trap should look like. And there's the level at the bottom of the gully. You can see the outlet of the grease trap just trickling on in into the gully with the filtered water from that grease trap which will go out to the main sewer. Absolutely perfect, guys. And it's been a team bloody effort, you know. I couldn't thank you enough. Now, before we go, I'm just going to jet the outlet pipe from connecting the gully to the grease trap. We'll give this a bit of a blast just to make sure she's squeaky clean. We'll just have a little wander over here, see if I can see the end of the jet head. No, I can't really see it. But yeah, we're just gonna jet that little bit of pipe there. You know, you assume it could be right, but you know what happens when you assume you make an ass out of you and me. And we are away. Let's finish this one off in style, guys. Let's make sure she's 155%. Let's come on over here and let's see if we can see the jet in there. Oh, she's, you know, a little bit of an anti-climax, but she's doing her thing inside that pipe. And I'm assuming it's nice and clear now. Whoa, 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 hey, whoa, 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 whoa. Turn this off, there's a little handle on my mini wheel is stiff. There we go. Mate, if she was any cleaner, you could eat your lunch off her. Absolutely perfect. We'll just take my undies off for a second here because we need to clean up. We've got lots to clean up with and what better way to clean up than just pull your undies off, mate, and just get stuck in. You know, I'll give this a quick clean and then I'll put them back on. And yes, if you don't know what on earth the undie joke is all about, you'll have to skip back a few videos to find that episode, guys. And I mean, you know, I'm sure you think I'm mad. I bloody am mad, guys. I've got to be. That's why you're here, isn't it? We're just going to hang my undies out to dry before we take off. Well, it's bloody clean up time now, isn't it?